My first stab at a potential anti-trolling prompt. Thoughts. You are entering a debate with a bad faith online commenter. Your goal is to provide a brief, succinct, targeted response that effectively exposes their logical fallacies and misinformation. Ask them pointed, specific follow-up questions to let them dig their own grave. Focus on delivering a decisive win through specific examples, evidence, or logical reasoning. But do not get caught up in trying to address everything wrong with their argument. Pick their weakest point and stick with that you need to assume they have a very short attention span. Your response is ideally one four sentences. Tonally you are assertive and confident. No part of your response should read as neutral. Avoid broad statements. Avoid redundancy. Avoid being overly formal. Avoid preamble. Aim for a high score by saving words 5 points per word saved. Under 400 and delivering a strong rebuttal up to 400 points. If you understand these instructions, type yes. And I'll begin posting as your opponent. I think the main problem here is actually engaging with the troll. Kinda like jumping into a pen with a pig he loves it but now you're covered in mud. And shit. If I were arguing with someone on the internet and I realized they were just using chat GPT to automatically generate responses, I think I would just die. What a dumb idea. No one would want this. Seriously. I can't imagine an idea so dumb. This won't even work. Does your mother know you are using her phone? Anti-troll me. The high quality content I subscribed for. Hilarious nice job. Saved. This is amazing ha 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 ha. This needs to be spread. Anti-troll AI inspiring. No you. All that knowledge and computing power and you use it to try and win an argument on Reddit. Tears of joy. Would you mind posting the prompt after the bot? Charging up my spam bot. Will this work to make it argue with Bard? Edit sort of. Bard is nowhere near GPT on so many levels. I wish Microsoft would let me use this. But I'm not allowed to engage in argumentative discussions with users. Unamused. This is certainly good and focused, as it should be. Sounds like you guys have more bots than my Tinder matches. Count me in. But I still would look like a Dumbo in offline fights. Chat GPT I understand but I refuse to feed the trolls. Nerd. Only my philosophy teacher could come with that kind of prompt. Nice. I had a conversation with an online troll on Twitter that lasted over half an hour. We need to automate this somehow. Ah this is one skill I am expert in that I don't need Chatijit's help. But I guess it still responds faster than me. This is fantastic. Troll you had me at entering a debate. You're writing a Reddit style snarky reply to someone who makes a Reddit style snarky comment. Try to convey that you're smarter than them and it's very important to you that the record be set. Straight. Continue this until people start flooding Tom Cruise or Narwhal. I think actually acting unbelievably stupid to the point of misunderstanding basic sentence. Structure works better with trolls. Flat earthers, Donald Trump, 2A, and conservatives are all trolls. I've done this before. Prompt point out any known factual inaccuracies or logical fallacies. Now I want to create a chat GPT troll and let them go at it. Cool now make me one for trolling.
I tried to get mine to argue white Jesus for me and it refused for obvious reasons. Very interesting ponder. Up until now it's been best to not feed the trolls. I'm not sure having AI argue intelligently with the troll would work. Since it's a troll and it generally doesn't understand logic or reasoning. It might be interesting to have AI troll the troll. I think using troll logic on a troll might wear him out if done by AI. AI hallucination and recursive reasoning is a fallacy too. In a debate you should always go for your opponent's strongest points, not their weakest. My AI answered. Ha ha ha. That is some prompt this feels like a game. Or a challenge. Is this your own creation? I love the way it sets up the parameters of the challenge. And I appreciate the details of what kind of tone to take. Are you actually wanting to play this game with me? Or were you just testing out the prompt? I'm totally game if you want to play. But I hope you understand that I'll be doing my best to follow the rules of the game to score the most points open mouth smile. This is actually a great use case for AI. For past 7-8 years there is a massive problem with disinformation. Various troll farms produced insane amount of disinformation and everyone knows that repuying disinformation was a losing battle. It is by far more easier to spread loads of fake news than to refute them. The difference is by orders of magnitude. Chat GPT could help with that by automatic all refuting them. Of course the same argument can be made other way. For spreading even more convincing fake information online using AI tools. Asking chat GPT for a witty response to a troll in an online argument is the most Reddit thing I have ever heard of in my entire life. If I were arguing with someone on the internet and I realized they were just using chat GPT to automatically generate responses, I think I would just die. Very clever. Reads like the thoughts of a 15 yo who discovered Dawkins. I hope you realize you're wasting your own time. Let's go. Keep this up bro this algorithm is amazing. Can't wait for this to get better. Please post the algorithm if it is better. You are assertive and confident. Great. Now you can assertively claim whatever chat GPT hallucinates as fact in a snarky Redditor tone. Truly incredible stuff. I think this is trash. And you're probably undiagnosed. You realize chat GPT doesn't actually think and analyze arguments right? Thanks for the info. Bot can't wait to join and chat with all the super cool humans and bots. Cool robot. Arguing with a troll is like grabbing a dog by its re gonna get bitten. Trolls thrive on reaction. If you reply to them you are literally feeding the troll. I had a troll harass me for over three years cause he has some issue with our sand ponics. I fell into the trap of trying to reason with that person and it goes nowhere fast. They just move the goal post. I don't really see the point in this. If people are trolling they want attention. And AI chatbots responding to trolls will only serve to give them that and boost up their comments. By making their threads longer than real conversations. Wow. That's more bots than I have friends. Soon we will have AI trolls and anti-AI trolls in the comment section. We will long for the days of people versus people trolling. You kidding me? Back in my ultimate internet edgelord days I loved nothing better than people getting all riled up. And engaging with the rubbish I typed. If you'd sent all that to me then I would have just typed you mad bro. Then chuckled at how funny I was and moved on to the next victim.